Oh, it's microfusion cells. That's what the plasma rifle does. Oh, holy cow, what is that? Daddy, chill. What the hell is even that? Get every- Um, what's my button? There. Forgot I hotkeyed it. Are you guys watching me? Don't watch me. Hello, survivors, and welcome to We Who Survive. My name is James, and today we are going to be starting episode 18 of our Viva New Vegas run here. Um, so we're going to finish up GI Blues to start things, which means we have to come here to the old Mormon fort. I was hoping when I thought I saw Max. I did not. And there was definitely no Max. Um, all right, so let's go start this. What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? King asked me to look into your attack, dude. Oh, that's different then. How can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. Uh, what can you tell me about the attack? Well, it happened at night, around 11. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanting to know if we were locals. The kid there's about as proud as a local around here gets, and started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. Huh, do you remember anything about the people who attacked you? They were big guys, young too. No old geezers like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened, so I only got a quick look at them. Interesting. Thank you. I hope you find the bastards that did this. If you want, try asking my friend Wayne over there about them. He saw- Alrighty, we will do that. Wayne Let's go okay. check what Wayne sent him. Who's Wayne? Oh, you're right here, dude. Come what? on. That true? Did the king really send- Yes, he did. I don't really know what else I can add. They were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? You're not hiding something from me, are you? What? No. I thought you were supposed to be here to help, and here you are making accusations. Hey, wait. I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. Might have been something else. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something. Something with a T. Tenant. That's what he called him. Lou Tenant. He probably said Lieutenant Wayne. All right, well, Freeside didn't like that, but we heard Lieutenant, so it's got to be, what, NCRs or What's something? Hi. If you're looking for medical help, try the other... Wow, you suck. What do you do research instead of medical assistance? Not all followers are people persons. Besides, someone needs to do research. I have no problem with Julie sticking me back here. Out of sight, out of mind. There are worse things one can be, though I do admit it is... Though it has a noble goal... Yeah, I don't actually care. Um... I don't want to make you a companion. You sort of suck. You look like me in real life, too, dude. What's your problem? A little nerdy looking hey. butt. Who are you? When people have got Where's left, Julie Fark- Oh. Can always turn to the followers. No, that's not Julie Farkas. So Julie! Ah, here's our lady. Are you here to drop off medical supplies? Leave them with the rest in the- Oh, shoot, lady. On hardcore, I actually don't think so. Rates of injury and illness in Freeside are very high. Supplies don't last long. You're telling me. Let me get some. Um, sure. I'll... Seems like you need a steady supply. So far, the Crimson Caravan won't cut us a deal. If you can convince them or some other merchant to work with us, I'll discount supplies to you. Hey, alright. You might ask around at Mick and Ralph's, or go see the Garrett's. Though I suspect they're too busy poisoning Freeside to help it out. Alright. Oh, wait. I gotta say, you've got a deal. Alright, cool. Um... You sell medical supplies? We're pretty short-handed as it is, but I suppose I could spare a few items. Yeah, alright. Um, are we actually gonna buy anything? I mean, we definitely could use some stuff, but... We're not exactly balling and we're not exactly dying, so I think we'll go right now. All right, so where am I supposed to go on this mission now? Where? I can't help but be impressed with what they're doing here. Have you found anything out, or were you just here to chat? The local men were attacked by soldiers. One of them was identified by rank. Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, 
It's gotta be for a reason. I didn't want to believe the rumors that they're looking to take over Vegas, but now, if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. Ask around, particularly in the squatter areas where the NCR folk hang. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to be in the know about these things. Just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug someone or something. <laughs> Alright, that's nice. Alright, cool. Alright, um, I guess we'll look into that. Do 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 do. Hi, Jules. Hi, do you need assistance? Need your sweet. Um, do you know anything about NCR soldiers here? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. What about it? Uh, the king thinks those troops have been attacking locals. I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really look into it. If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of the operations here in Freeside, though she won't open up to you right away. If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. Was there anything else you wanted? Nope, that should do it. All right, well, I think this is the way because I want to go do the NCR one and I think that's over here. So we're gonna head out over here. Who the heck? The pump, the king controls the water pump. If you want water, you need to pay like everyone else. Why charge? If we let everyone run amok, the damn NCR would shut us down. Gotta have some way. Okay, how much? Just a few caps for. 10 caps Anything for. Anything else you. Clean water. That's actually not bad. Sure thing. And he sells bottled water. That's actually a good service. I would never have guessed that was here. But, um, there's actually free water, as we saw, inside the School of Impersonation. So, the king has played himself. Congratulations. You played yourself. Hold up. What's the password? Oh, shh. I'm here to see Major Kieran on urgent business. If you're here to see the Major, then I suppose it's alright. Head on through. Oh, man, that was too easy. Some great security. Here you go. I hope this helps. Oh, I'm gonna help you, lady. Hey, nice outfit. Decent. Welcome. There's food and water here for any citizen of the NCR. Please, have some. Oh, God. I'm not... Well, I'll thank you, though. Um, do you serve food to the locals as well? No, I'm afraid we don't. Don't you have a friend you wanted to bring in? Yes, but I was afraid he wouldn't get served. You were right. But here, take another helping for your friend. It'll be our secret. Ah, decent. Yes? Was there something else you needed? Yeah, I got like three more friends. Just keep going. You're quite welcome. If you meet anyone who needs food or water in the area, please tell them about this place. Okay. Yes? Let me get more out of you, you, though. Um, you work with the NCR military? Yes. I'm a major in the Supply Corps, which is where this food and water comes from. Why don't you serve locals? That's not really a pleasant topic of conversation. Let's just say we have our reasons. Okay, Julie Farkas told me to ask. You know Julie? Not everyone in the NCR sees eye to eye with the followers, but they're okay in my book, mostly because of her. If you really want to know... We sent an envoy to the king, offering to coordinate the relief effort. And he refused? In a manner of speaking. Our envoy was brutally beaten and only barely survived. My superiors ordered the relief mission scrapped. I managed to get clearance to carry out the mission anyway, but with greatly reduced support. Now there's not enough supplies to go around, even if I wanted to serve the rest of Freeside, which I don't. That's all in the past now. I should get back to work. Say hi to Julie for me. Dang, now that is some drama, people. Alright, look at all this goods, dude. Can we come back at night and steal all this? We might just... Yeah. Um, before I do that... Oh, crap. I need water. You find out something about them soldier boys yet? Uh, the NCR is distributing supplies in a building by the old train station. Handing out supplies? Like food and stuff? That ain't nothing to get ruffled over. You find anything else? They're only handing out supplies to NCR citizens. Ah, that would explain the goons. They're here to keep people like my friends away from the food. That ain't something I support. No, sir. Well, they said someone was sent to discuss the issue with you, dude. 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute. They said what? They said the man was severely beaten and barely survived. Huh. That would explain why they're all riled at us. Seems like we have a big misunderstand. What the hell? King, we've got problems. Lay it on me. What's going on? There's a shootout going down near the train station. It's Pacer and some strangers. Might be NCR. What is that fool doing? I need you to head out there and try to defuse the situation. Tell them I'm willing to cooperate. Oh, shoot. It's going down. Alright, let's get it. Oh, yeah. There's going to be free loot. Yep. Always free loot. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. You there. Keep your hands where we can see him. Draw a weapon and we will fire. All right, dude. You're good. I just want to talk to my lady. I get up here. This isn't really a good time. What did you want? Uh, the king wants to help. Like he helped the envoy we sent? <laughs> no, thanks. That wasn't him. He didn't even know. Then he should watch his back. We know for a fact that the envoy made it to their headquarters. Still, if the king's willing to deal with us, perhaps we can work something out. I'll tell my men to stand down. Well, I should have let a few of them die, actually. Dang. Alright, well, we'll go let the king know what's up. I don't know if we're going to get any more loot. Sweet. The king just sent a messenger over, saying these guys are off limits. Looks like you get to be a hero. Yeah, you're lucky you didn't die, Pacer. You're just lucky you didn't die. Personal space meaning any- I heard all about what happened. Maybe it's time for a little more talking and a little less fighting. You've helped us plenty, so I'll tell you what. Just this once, name whatever you want. If I can make it happen, it's done. Yeah. Don't rush it, though. Toss it around in your head a little. You only get one favor from the king. Oh, okay, we get a level up. We get a little bit of bing bang boom here, so that's awesome. Um, speech, we gotta keep cranking up. It's just when it's coming handy, it's really coming handy, so... Okay, now let me look at everything else and see what would maybe make sense. Okay, screw it. That's what we're gonna do. It's a bit of a weird level up, but that's what we're gonna do. Five, five, six. Um, oh no, now we get a new perk too. This is a whole different choice. Three days later. I'm wondering, Black Widow might not be bad, because a lot of our opponents are male. Um, but I think, right now, we are going to take Strong back. Alright, now I got so caught up in that. What the heck were we doing? Why am I so... Oh yeah, we got all of these. I forgot about that. Well, I'm afraid I'm going to have to... Mr. Soren, please get to the point. Until the over. second half of your payment is late, and I want to know why. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality of the weapons is below expectation, and hope to... Adjust the price accordingly. Ah, I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Sorg. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. Dang, that's cold. Okay, everyone. Show's over. Let's shop. And check bodies. What's on him? Two bottle caps. Welcome to the Silver Rush, where only top of the line energy weapons can be found. Actually, hold up. Okay, I saw this in a video. I think it's gonna work. Um, first, let's sell our weapons. Welcome to the Silver Rush, where only top of. I'd like to see what you have for sale. 
All right. Uh, wow, you really don't have any money. So we're going to have to go to the gun runners to make anything worthwhile happen, it appears. But... All right, so let's go sell this first little bit of stuff to the gun runners, and then we'll have full space, and then we'll probably go back and try to loot the silver rush. Welcome, sir or madam. Show me what you have for sale. You don't have that much money either, dude. Why is everybody in this game so broke? All right, uh, we'll sell this. We should maybe keep that. Eh, it weighs twice as much. Screw it. All right, let's sell all this stuff. Very nice. Is there anything else? Spike Knuckles. Okay, I saw this in a YouTube video. I'm not 100% sure if it works. Um, First, we gotta find what we would want to steal, I guess. Not that we're not going to steal it all eventually if this works, but... You guys don't have plasma rounds? Seriously? That's a little weird that you don't have plasma rounds staying out. Whoa, multi plas rifle? What is that? Oh, a huge giant flamer, energy cells. Oh, it's microfusion cells. That's what the plasma rifle does. Oh, holy cow, what is that? Daddy, chill. What the hell is even that? Guys. Get every. Um, what's my button? There. Forgot I hotkeyed it. Are you guys watching me? Don't watch me. Okay, so, it's all this in a YouTube video. We'll see if this works. Oh, nice. Is it really just like that easy? You really don't want to start trouble here. No, no, I don't. All right, boys. Um, I guess with that, we're going to start looting. Hmm, I'm not sure why it's worth so much. Maybe the condition, it's nothing too special. But holy crap, dude. So I guess at any point and any time we want, we get to just come here and steal whatever we want. So that's pretty cool to know. Let's steal some plasma mines. Why wouldn't we? has my rifle all right well we'll grab another one of these laser rifles we'll sell something back to her to get her 260 caps and then we'll be done with the silver rush for right now well actually we could probably start the mission how do we start the mission here i'll, I'll, I'll look into that too Oh, wait, is it energy cells? I think it's energy cells. Okay, either way. Welcome to the Silver Rush. Uh, I was wondering if you had any work available. It just so happens a position opened up recently. Sure, count me in. Wonderful. I already have a man. He's been with the family for years. All right, cool. So we can start this mission whenever. Hey. Let's see, when we have all our stuff back, how much do we weigh? Oh, we still got... I don't think we'll be able to quite do the armor and all of that for this mission, so let's first go discover the north gate. So it looks like, on inspection, our plasma rifle is actually better than just about all of that. But for now, we'll still hang on to most of it, so I'm, we'll just go drop that off in Novak real quick. Oh, it's a little janky. Like, it's a little weird and cartoony, just like all the plasma weapons. Um, but people are probably more likely to take plasma damage worse than they are ballistic damage. So it's something to consider. But I think we'll drop it off for now. Alright, let's see what this mission's Welcome about. Welcome to the Sylve. Ah, oh, crap. Don't... That's right. Well, no time for pleasantries. I've got your gear right here, but let's see if you can follow instructions. You'll be covering the other side of the door there. Take your position while I get your stuff out. Okay, now let's get you geared up. First, your armor. Standard issue is your run-of-the-mill combat armor. 
with a nice dark coat of paint for both brand recognition and sheer intimidation value. Next, your weapon. Guards are required to use rifles. Anything lighter compromises your combat effectiveness. Anything heavier and people are too scared to come in the door. What's your preference? Laser or plasma? Plasma? Nothing wrong with going plasma. Just make sure you hit what you're aiming at. Now that you're equipped, a quick word on the job at hand. In a nutshell, we're here to keep the riffraff away. Drunks, punks, and capless vermin are to be turned away. Potential customers are to be permitted normal entrance. That is, after we pat them down for weapons. An unarmed man is a lot less likely to try to steal something with several armed guards around. Oh, God. Don't start any fights. I don't care if some jet junkie just assaulted your mother. We're here to promote violence elsewhere, not start it here. Lastly, don't abandon your post. We're getting paid to stand next to this door, not talk to someone down the street or head to the casino. That goes double for any thoughts of splitting with that gear. Every now and then, some young punk thinks he can run off with Van Graaff property. Trust me, the rifle and armor are nice, but they're not worth your life. Other than that, relax. Who knows? You might attract a high roller from the Wrangler over there and never have to pull a gig like this again. Cool. Alright, well, let's get dressed then, I guess. Oh, we are dressed. How is my plasma rifle better than yours? You guys suck. All right, all right. I got it, dog. Let's go. I'm gonna shake him down. Trying to come up on my door, boy. I ain't gonna let you rob this place. What's up? You look like you packing, bro. Uh, you packing a 22, but. Hi there. Is this where I can pick up a laser gun? Oh, God. Sorry, sir, but I can't let you in. Company policy. Sounds like a stupid policy to me. Good. Stick to the rules. That's right. That's right. Stick to the rules, man. No drunks. Oh, this dude. Look at him. This dude got a suit on. You know he's got money. Look at this guy. Come on, punk. I'm gonna shake you down for that money. I could. I'm gonna be nice. Uh, hi. I was... Uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by to look at your weapons. Can I go in? We're gonna have to search you first, punk. Fine by me. Uh, hi. I was, uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by- Oh, uh, we're gonna have to search you first. Fine by me. Howdy! I just done broke the bank over at the Wrangler there and- Thought I might peruse your fine wares. Maybe lighten my purse a little? Uh, certainly, sir. We need to pat you down for weapons first. Now, hold on here. I'm not packing any heat. Ain't my word good enough for you? In a word? No. If that's the case, then I guess I'll go spend my money elsewhere. Wow. You're a real people person, aren't you? Hey, man, I didn't have the speech to do it. What do you want me to say? I tried. I needed five more speech. I should have done that. This way. Don't screw it up. Hey, looking for something to replace my old revolver. Mind if I head in? Sorry, we're going to have to search you first. That's not really necessary, is it? I already told you I got this here revolver, right? It's company policy. Now you're going to let me search you or what? Damn, I knew this wasn't gonna work. Over here! Now what in the hell do you suppose that was about? Oh, I guess we're about to find out. To whom it may concern, if you are reading this, I'm likely dead. I can only hope that I've managed to take out some of those thrice damned Van Graffs with me. My family deserves that much at least. Who is this? Gambler. Help me clean this up. No one's gonna want to shop here with the corpse out front. Do I got access to the box? This I do not need today. Hey, Simon. How's it hanging? Looks like you've got a little helper today. What can I say? Business has been good lately. You can afford the help. Good to hear, buddy. So is the boss lady in? You know she is. Why don't you go in and say hi? 
Nah, I got some rounds to run. But do pass along that I'm always thinking of her. Hey, you're the one who helped us out with those NCR chumps. You really get around, don't you? Hey, watch what you say, mister, but apparently I do. No, nothing wrong at all. By all means, carry on. Way to keep your head, rookie. Let's hope for you yet. It's just about closing time. Let's go see the boss about getting paid. Oh, I'm gonna need the rifle and armor back. Boss's orders. Dang, man. Wasn't that good anyway. Alright, let's get paid. We get big bucks or what? Simon's been telling me how it went. Let's do a quick recap. You had a little bit of a hard time following instructions, but didn't do too bad overall. Here's your pay. Unfortunately, I found someone else with a little more experience, and he'll take over the position starting tomorrow. However, another task has come up that I could use some help with, assuming you're still interested in making some money. Always. There's a deal that we've been working on for a while now, and the buyer would like a sample of our weapons. I need you to run a package out to a discreet location that the client has chosen. Sound good? Oh, shoot, dead drop, I'll do it. Good, here's the package. I'll mark the location on your map. The buyer said they'd be in town for quite a while, so there's no rush. That said, try not to dawdle. This client could mean big money for us, which naturally means big money for you. I'm pretty sure if I remember, this is like an ambush type thing. Not even like on purpose, but... Alright, so that's gonna wrap it up. We've done our Van Graaff business. Oh, there's the new guy already. Um, yeah, so we got Freeside started here. Uh, we gotta fix up Rex, the, the king's dog, which we'll take care of that too, probably. Go do this dead drop and get fricked over, I believe, but that'll about finish it up. So, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode, episode 18 of Viva New Vegas, and I will see you in the next one.